Hello everyone, welcome back to more Space Pirates and Zombies. Let's see if I can get this damn thing done. The plug work beacon. Alright, let's just get the ship in there nice and easy. We shouldn't have any issues. Do, do anything out of the ordinary here, keep the damn safety on. Escort the transport. Alright, see, we're just, we're just, you know, regular guys. Just doing our thing. Do, 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 nothing suspicious. We're just heavily armed pirate warships flying towards your dock. Nothing out of the ordinary. <laughs> See? Nothing at all. Well, tall ships. The base is being hijacked. Oh, it is. Get civilian and pirate targets. Do whatever it takes to stop them from capturing the base. Just throw the base if you have to. Hey! Ah, damn. Here we go. Back off from my base. Well, I'll defend this base. With my deadly guns. Just destroy it. Destroy it. Uh, ooh, excellent. I like that big laser you've got there. That'll make this job a whole lot easier. Maybe I'll just interpose myself between the two of you. There we are. Yep, I'm just going to block that missile. And that's you dead. Defend. Gotta block it out. Yeah. See, you can't shoot through me. <laughs> ah, good. Now the base will get more health while I blow up this other guy. Yeah, he won't even make it. Oh, that doesn't sound pleasant at all. Oops. Oh, stop moving around me. Hold still so that I can block you. There we go. Another one dead. Hack time, 50 seconds. I can do 50 seconds. Wee. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. I like that big-ass laser he keeps blasting with. 30 seconds. Half a minute? Eh, it won't be long. Though I see on the radar there, they got a big warship flying in. Time to go intercept that. Back off away from my, sh my thing. <gasps> 16 seconds! Yes, block it! Use your own ship as the defense! Yes, perfect. Good old Mac here be tapping in them systems. I saw how to do it on that TV thing. Looks like everything a few months these folks get goodie bags from an egghead base in the sector next door. I used to say, but I couldn't help my put myself a few red buttons. Seems like the station's gonna self suck, so I'll be hoping you guys can open the docking bay. Mac is coming home. You damn moron. Get up the station, we'll track you in. Then across that egghead station. Pick up Mac. Alright, I can do that. Yeah, see? Picked up Mac. And we'll just blow up that guy. Ugh, double explosion. Ah, well, there's valuable loot. 
Oops, you know. Not a complete waste. Mass retreat! Now then. There we are, next door sector. <laughs> Hello, next door sector. Oh, welcome. Uh, we have been expecting you for some time. I'm assuming you have a plethora of questions about the res we are supplying. Uh, yeah. Well, I have to disappoint you, but I don't have much in the way of answers for you at present. The res we receive here, though still very potent, isn't quite pure, and thus we can't analyze it. However, seeing as you Tay won't tell us what the substance really is, we'll have to find out for ourselves. This is where you come in. Alright, sounds you have some kind of plan laid out for us ready. What exactly do you have in mind? My expertise has allowed me to locate a potential vein of res that might be pure and untainted. The UT have no idea where it's located, but they will find it eventually. I'd go have it myself, but I'm sure you understand my personal involvement will only draw UT attention. You seem to have no trouble, uh, no problem going where you please. Therefore, I suggest that we walk toward the common goal. Go harvest this pure res, and I'll share with you any significant findings. How impeccably organized. I must confess that I think I'm in love. Oh, damn, Carl. I think she's nearly 80 years old. Perhaps I'll, sli Perhaps I'll slip, fall, crack my head, and I'll be rid of the damn mental image. Mac, but thinking he had enough for the summer today. I'm gonna log a guy here with the make it. Kids have fun, be home in time for supper. Alright. Uh, Dark Science Base. I could do that. But first, I want that little. There we are. Always worth getting tech. The real deal. Alright. How is the purity deposit? Done! Let's get out of here. People want to know what's the mystery? What's up with the zombies? What's up with the res? There we are. Mm -hmm. I'm sure it's nothing suspicious. All right, harvest the res. All right, easy enough. I'm sure there will be no complications. Hmm. Except for little zombies occasionally, but you know. That is to be expected. Do 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 do. Flying towards my res. Interesting, it seems that. Each of those res deposits had zombies in them. Could there be a connection between zombies and the res? Hmm. I'm sure it's a coincidence. Just a coincidence that I'm being chased by zombies. Stuff. Yeah, alright. Uh, nine deposits left. Alright, well, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Mm -hmm. Six. One more should do it. There we are. Perfect. Nothing suspicious at all. Well, this is very interesting. As this rail has zombie DNA all over it. It's a fairly simple task to wipe it clean while still preserving the transmutable properties. It appears the UTA have been doing this to keep anyone from making the connection. So what you're saying, 
This stuff is zombie shit? Ugh. You see, I've been knowingly stirring the horses all this time. We're so many human lives. It doesn't make any sense. It's hard to tell exactly what res is supposed to be, but I would highly doubt it to be excrement. If I had to guess, I'd say it's bait. Mm -hmm. Res can only be used to fabricate basic alloys, nothing biological. These zombie gyps can't reproduce without the materials our bodies provide. What better way to draw in space faring races than this a transmutable element that we can't replicate? They reproduce, they produce something we need in turn, we feed them. That would stop those UTA bastards. Everything's hooked on the stuff now. That explain why the UTA sir well kept out here. They have all the res they'll ever need, but right next to this shit store. Considering how advanced this stuff is, I'd suggest there is some kind of intelligent being behind it. There must be a primary hive somewhere. I presume we're inevitably going to attempt to destroy it. I see let's go, simply because I adore having a sample of whatever this thing is. Well, this is a little disheartening. But none of it comes as a surprise. The rest of the will more important to one of the course. The source must be there. Fortunately, no gauge I know of actually go there. You were talking about that cloak warp gate those UTA folk keep talking about when they think I'll not be listening. I think I do reckon I do know where it be. I drew a cram app for y'all. Cloak warp gate, eh? Mac, you're an amazing man. You know that? Unless there's any objections, let's send a course and get this done. Point no return, people. Let's make sure we have everything we're going to need before crushing that line. Over a century of cash for all this? Damn. We're just going to supposed to make some quick cash inside the galaxy. How do we end up responsible for all this? No, this feels right. Oh, you're so whiny. I'm sure there's nothing bad that's going to happen. <sighs> mm, tasty free beverages. So... Here we are. Infected. Let's go to the final sector. Save the galaxy. There it is. The last warp gate. Uh, yes. I'm absolutely sure. I've, I've gotten all the stuff. I've maxed out most of the, the stuff. I'm good. Sure enough, there are cloak generators. It's roughly enough power to keep getting. Let's pop those bitches and get this show on the road. Alright. Six cloak generators. Six cloak generators. And... There. A son of a bitch is out the generators. Stop it now! Well, what a surprise. You always keep a close eye on us, aren't you? Ha ha ha, Carl. Uh, he has only one eye. It's funny. Do-do-do. Do-do-do. All right. Aw. The UTA doesn't like it when I blow up the generators. I wonder why that could be. Oh, hello, enemy warship. I think I'm gonna have to destroy you, aren't I? Mono e mono. Blaster against blaster. Lasers against lasers. Whoa, there's a bunch of bastards, isn't there? Oh, well, that's fine. Now, if it's just a sign to appear, damn you, Don! You really start a harness ass here. You're making the mistake of a lifetime. I'm sorry, I'm not listening to what you say. Because I'm blowing up your ships. Now, these guys are these are advanced ships. Level 80? It's a high level ship. i it might be worth my while to ignore it. Uh wow. I'm making little headway against this guy. Okay, I'm gonna rotate my ship so it can fire at my ass while I work my way through his main front armor. Yeah, that's right. Tactics, my friend. Tactics! Using tactics against them. You won't say, how is. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. 
I should put those guys back on auto rebuild. There we are. My God, how much? Uh, I think I've started to break through his defenses. There we are. See, by his, his arm is finally going red, which means he's dying. There. Did it, did it, did it. I'm about to do it. I'm about to break him. And... A little more, a little more, a little more. Yes. Ah, oh, all right, so. I'm going to mostly ignore the bastards now, I think. Uh, okay. Ah, damn it, they're opposites. Of course they would be. What else would they do? Hmm. Well, I'm going to ignore them now. We're focusing on just breaking down the generators. That was a tough battle. I need my ships to have better guns. Hmm. There's a, f there's a type of laser beam that would probably be perfect. What would I do? But I would take time to upgrade. Damn it. Should have spent my points more wisely. Come on. Break. Smashy smash. Alright. Two left. I also need to upgrade my crew so they don't... Uh, they don't take as long to fix things. Yeah, I'm just gonna let the zombies and, and the other guys fight amongst themselves. There's no reason for me to get involved in this little brouhaha they have going. Even if it is costing me my own ships, but you know. Not a huge deal. I want to know what's going on. Don't you want to know what's going on? You, kind viewer. Man, this thing is out there. Damn it, my beacon! Well, that's gonna complicate matters. Oh well. One more. Then we can warp out of here. The final gate. The final jump. There it is. There it, there it, there it is. There it is. Hey, friendly gate. Like a little handy hand. Ah, oh, damn it! I don't want to make this get into this fight right now. Uh, don you bastard! Don't think I'm following anywhere you go. Hells them! Follow them now! So I, I guess we're jumping and they're jumping after us. All right. Yeah, it's gonna be a little longer of an episode. Doesn't matter. There we are. Where are we? What? Hey, hey, guy. Uh, there's a big black evil thing. Uh, okay, but what in the name of fuck is that thing? Forget the damn renegades. Just leave them here. Ever to the escape pods. Fall back. The gate now. Uh, oh, maybe some sort of doomsday weapon. Looks pretty doomy. Yep, and that killed him. Uh, oh, this is not going to end well. I don't know what the hell is going on. Crew life signs are dropping. We breached all the damn place. The weapons attack is coming down. We're totally screwed. We need to evacuate now. Curses. This thing knows our system codes. It's rigging the reactor to blow. How did this be possible? This codes are 128 billion bit encrypted. That's a lot of bits. I'm truly sorry. I left the reactors invulnerable. I don't want things down this way. 
but I was knew they would. I can't explain more than that. It won't allow me to. Whoa, it won't allow me to. <gasps> Don, are you a traitor? Please, just get off the ship while you sail at the time. Don, it was you? No, that's impossible. I mean, sailing your own kind, you son of a bitch. Ilson, we need to evacuate now. We have no time left. What a twist! Oh no! My ship! Oh. Oh. And so the clockwork was destroyed, overcome by the zombie essence. Suddenly, as the essence had appeared, it had again vanished, taking the ruins of the clockwork and Don Gibson along with it. Without a titan beam, the battered remnants of the clockwork's fleet remained stranded. Son of a bitch. Damn you, zombie essence. Damn you, Don! The essence nowhere to be found. Elsa and Carl began the impossible task of building a new titan ship. With the help of hundreds of refugees and an endless supply of rares, a new flagship slowly took shape. Once finished, they had been stranded for nearly five years, unaware of the new strife besetting the rest of the galaxy. Five years? That's, uh, that's a long time. We're back. We've got things fixed. Got a new ship. New guns. I find humorous irony in the fact that it's been five years today since we started out like this. And they're like about to be given new life. You're not going to stop me now, are you, Carl? Let's save the sap for the pub when we get the hell out of here. Okay, powering up the warp engines. Wait a minute. Well, of course. It doesn't work now, does it? Unfortunately, your alcoholic tendencies will have to wait a bit longer. I was a fool to expect the ship to fire up on the first try. I am unable to maintain a lock with them on the neighboring warp gates. There is some residual zombie infection in the system that is somehow inhibiting our jump engines. We're basically caught in the spider's web, so we'll have to clear the infestation here before we can leave. Shit! We get back on the horse, just get kicked out right back off again. Back call. And let's deal with this quickly. I'm tired of drinking degreaser for my jollies. Maybe you should read this. Ah, more hangers. Welcome to the Clockwork 2. Not much to look at, but neither was the last one. Try not to blow this one up. Ah, oh, brand new mothership, sort of. <laughs> but I, have another, I can have another uh, another ship, so that's nice. And we're going to do that. Um, so. So, change you to. No. No. Yes. All right. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna play around with refitting my ship, and I'll uh, see you all next time. Thanks for watching.